Hello everyone. Hi. So today I'm just going to walk you through my application on um, Bubble. So I created this um, application. It's a web application that enables you to manage and track your team projects conveniently. Right. And um, the main purpose I'm creating this is for potential clients and employers out there who might be interested in you know um, using my services to help build a platform or build an idea that you have similar to this right and um, yeah so i've been doing bubble for i'll say within three to six months so i have a bit of intermediate experience but i think i should be able to bring your ideas to life and that's the idea behind this demo so i'm just going to showcase something that i've used recently and so the name is project power right and you know so it has functionalities for users to log in so if i click here you know um so i can just log in right and this is grayed out because once i put in my details for example i put in my details my email and i put in my password so you can see the password is you can see it becomes you know black so I'm going to come back here. So I'm just going to click sign up here. If I'm not a user, I'm just going to cancel this. Sorry. So, and you know, you can easily go ahead to sign up here, but I'm not going to sign up. I'm just going to log in. So it's a sweet app I just created. And you know, so I'm just going to log in now. And I'll put my password. Okay. All right, so it's logged me in, right? And this is like my dashboard for, you know, um, for my project. So I can create different kinds of projects. So for example, if I click on this new project, I can create a new project, you know, where I can be working on. So I can just say um, mouse creation project. So let's say I'm trying to create a new kind of mouse and I can assign this project to myself. I can assign it to that Trevor and some other people. So these are the people that will be working on this project. So if they log in, they would see this project while others will not see this mouse creation project. So if I come here and click on mouse creation project, it shows me I don't have any task under new progress or completed. And I also cannot search, you know, uh, if I search it won't bring out anything, right? So I can click on new task in this mouse creation project. And when I do that, it brings out this floating group by the side, which, you know, I can just name this, um, you know, uh, so I can name the first task to register the domain for the mouse, right? So that's just the quick task. I can set the due date to the next two days, right? And, um, status i can just put this under new no sorry in pro in new sorry and then percentage i can just put 20 percent it's in progress and um, let's just leave it as responsive so i cannot say register domain on namechip.com and then i can assign this task to myself and to that driver, so two of us. So if I click save, so what now happens is on that new, it shows the new task that I have, right? So I can then go, I'll see the, the name, the status, the due date, the progress, you know, of the task, the assignees, and then I can click on edit, and this brings out, you know, I can go ahead to edit my task. Right, and then I can close this. So if I edit this, if I don't want that travel here, if I want just if I want Kool-Aid marketing here, and if I want to change this from name chip to let's say we're not going with name chip anymore, we're going with GoDaddy. And let's say the progress now is at 45%. You know, and it's no longer new and it's not in progress. I just click on save. 
So what happens is that it no longer comes under this tab and then now it's in progress and I can see that there are new assignees and things of that nature. So I can also leave a note, right? I can type in what I want here. Um, progress made um, with new with an affordable supplier. So that would save that as a task, right? And then I can delete this task. So if I go ahead and delete this task, it brings out a pop-up. Do you want you want to delete this task? So I can say no, or I can delete it and go ahead and delete it. And there we go. I don't have anything. So you can see it's a very um, amazing platform. If I come under analytics, it shows me you know the progress of the tasks right based on the due dates i can check different tasks this is fun galore this is registration mouse question because we don't have any tasks nothing is showing and then because i'm an admin i'm logged in with my admin account i can see the different tasks of everybody so i can know who is busy and who is not busy and then i can you know filter this based on the different projects so you can see i have 17 tasks but if i put it on project power it shows I have just 12 tasks on that project power and it shows other people as well. And as you can see, these people don't have a, a profile, right? So if I go back to the top, for example, I have a profile page. If I click on this settings button, you know, and I click on this, it gives them the option to upload, you know, their profile. So I'm just going to cancel this. So you can go ahead to upload your profile and then you can fill in details of your profile here and then click save and then it fills in there. So that's just a simple walkthrough of my platform. Please, if you have any projects that you would like me to work on for you, you can reach out to me on akwambidamla at gmail.com and we can begin discussing the project and I'll be glad to work with you. All right, take care and bye-bye.